Hello, um, I am here to show you a thing that I made yesterday and today. It's probably the biggest structure I've made in my entire Minecraft experience. Uh, it's not as big as a lot of things that other people make, but uh, actually it, it hi it's hiding right behind this tree. Uh, it is an Imperial ATAT -AT walker uh, that stands for All Terrain Armored Transport. Um, You'd probably recognize it from the Hoth battle in uh, the Star Wars movies from episode four, five, six, one of those. Um, and uh, so I just built it, and it's about one to one scale. I I didn't actually do any measurements, but um, here I'll give you a better view view from the front. Um, I just finished the outside yesterday, and the inside I was working on today, so I'm going to show you that real soon. Um, so there's the cockpit, and the two main guns, and the side guns, which are <laughs> all one meter square in, in cross-sectional area, uh, which is a little big, but you know, it's Minecraft. So uh, these legs were really hard to do, but uh, I spent a lot of time trying to get the detail just right, so it was recognizable, and I think I did a pretty good job. Uh, but right here I put a ladder, which isn't in the actual uh, at, at but you know, it's a convenient way to get in. Um, because the original at, -AT I think, had uh, little cables that would pull people up, or it had a docking bay. But anyway, this is the main room. Uh, you can have a bunch of people standing here with their guns and stuff. You know, they've got little enclaves for uh, soldiers. And back here, uh, we've got minecart storage, which in, in the actual films would probably have held uh, uh, speeder bikes. And then up here, I have a non-functioning engine reactor room. <laughs> Uh, because for some reason whenever I do set time in the server console it stops all my redstone circuits. Um, but anyway, uh, we've got some tables and railings, lots of glowstone blocks, uh, some shelving for uh, weapons and things like that, and down here you can go into the main cockpit area, which, got, which, has, which has some little decorative things, you know, benches, tables, um, you know, just imagine them as consoles. Uh, but it's a pretty nice view of what you're shooting at. Uh, and uh, so, if we go back here, um, you'll notice that there's also an upstairs level for troop storage, and uh, and this place is fairly more open. It's got bigger shelves, um, and up here we have pistons because I wanted to use pistons, even though the mechanism for opening them isn't all that great. Uh, we have open hatches in the top, uh, which is a fairly new feature um, to this model. Um, and it wasn't in the original Star Wars version of this thing, but uh, I figured I wanted to put it in just because I wanted to do something with pistons. Um, anyway, so uh, that's the ATAT, um, and I'm just gonna jump outside again real quick and give you one last look around at it, and uh, then I'll I'll be on my way. Uh, so thank you all for watching this video, and I hope you can appreciate this creation as much as I do. I really had a lot of fun making it, and uh, and I actually got the idea from another forum user uh, who was looking at this big, tall, blocky thing and was like, hey, that looks like an at, -AT. So I was like, no, this, this looks like an at, -AT. <laughs> Alright, thanks for watching.